Well, this is a shame, but yesterday I got through about 220 square feet of uh, the space that I'm core aerating manually, which is a lot. I mean, it took a while. It's a lot of energy to, to do. But finally, finally my manual core aerator, the Yard Butler, which I've had for a few years now, uh, got a rock jammed up in there and it actually bent the tine on the inside. It didn't even really look bent. Uh, but it's bent enough that no matter what happens when I clear uh, When I cleared it out it clogs instantly on one plug So if I just push push it into the ground once uh, It clogs and then I have to go clear it again. It's only one one of the two tines. So the other one works just fine, but I Mean it's bound to happen Especially after three years of use I guess so I had to stop. I wasn't able to continue going I Never would have been able to finish the whole thing yesterday anyway. I just had too much going on. But today, I wanted to finish the rest of it. But I'm, I don't want to finish it with a with a core aerator that only one of them is pulling cores. The other one is just compacting the soil. So, I had to go to four different stores this morning. No, it was three different stores this morning trying to find a, repla a replacement core aerator without having to buy one online and wait a few days. Because I really want to get this done today. So, I like Yard Butler. I like a lot of their tools. But the only core aerator I could find locally was this Corona uh, brand, which I picked up from Home Depot. It's the same style. And honestly, it's a little bit bigger, certainly a little bit taller. Looks like I got a wider space to pull cores there, you know, for my foot. And I don't know, like, this thing feels sturdier all around. Like, this is just a, a hard thing and this feels hollow. But the tines themselves, they might. This might be a more durable tine. I'll have to start using it and figure it out. But anyway, I'm going to finish this section. Hopefully today. That's another 220 square feet. So I'm running out of time. Hopefully I can get through it all. But I'm going to be finishing it with my Corona. And I guess this one is just going to be a really fancy doorstop now. The problem here is which tine is it? This one right here, see how I hit that rock? I hit something and it bent that in and somehow or other the inside of it is jacked up enough. Like it's just, I don't know, there's some, it doesn't look wrong, but this tine will not pull a core out anymore. So, I don't know. I'm not a salesperson for a yard butler by, by any means. So uh, whatever gets the job done, hopefully the corona does. <laughs> 